Okay, so this is my Giant Sequoia video from 2023. This is the end of October here, almost November. We got, this one did the best, I've got three. This is the original one. This is, I, I believe, six years old. It's 58 inches tall. This one's, I think, 72 inches tall and it's only five years old. I'm gonna show you the, the growth from this one. Started off the year here, so look at that point. And it shot all the way up to there. So it, it almost doubled in size. It started at 34 inches, ended up 72, so more than doubled. Um, this guy here did not do as good, uh, grew 20 inches. And then the original one only grew six inches, but it looks really healthy. So I'm starting to prepare to winterize these things again. Um, I'm right outside of Chicago, 40 miles west. So you get an idea of where I'm from. That trunk there is about two, two and a half inches in girth. Uh, it started out the year at one and a half, so, or 1.6 or something. So this, this one grew substantially. I'm gonna show you how I winterize these. And I don't know, I don't even know if it's necessary anymore because they're kind of established, but they're still small enough to where I can manage it. So I'm gonna keep on winterizing them. So I've got this, this net here and I've got these uh, stakes that I pound in. And then the insulation that I use are just leaves. These are from the oak trees over here. Um, so anyway, I use some some pull ties here, and um, I uh, do one one round at a time, fill up with leaves, and then uh, just kind of stack the leaves up until the tree's more or less covered. Uh, and then I will snip that off, and it'll be all wrapped up. I think I'm using burlap for these two because I don't have enough of this wire stuff, but. Um, this recipe has gotten them to survive three or four winters so far, and they're all still growing. This one took off the most, so um, we'll just keep seeing if these giant sequoias can make it here in Illinois. Okay, so I've bundled this one up. You can see like the tree there poking through at the bottom. I might try to shake some more leaves down to fill that in. Like I said, I used a fence for that one. Um, this one I used burlap, and I don't know what's better. And honestly, I don't even know if this is still necessary. We do get down to negative 25 degrees below zero Fahrenheit sometimes, um, big winds and whatnot. Um, I know when the trees were really small, like, you know, a foot, 18 inches tall, they did die um, and they have survived with this type of treatment. Obviously, if they get real big, this won't be practical. So I'm just trying to get them as established as possible. And then, so use the twist ties there, not twist ties, pull ties. I probably will throw this burlap out next year. I got a little bit of the tree sticking up there. I may throw some insulation on that. I haven't decided yet. I'm kind of curious if the stuff that sticks out like here makes it because then that tells me um, maybe some of this stuff starts to become unnecessary as the tree gets established. All right, so here um, I started measuring this tree when I planted it. It was a three-year-old tree when I got it. Um, I, first measurement you can see was March 1st, 2019 at 17 inches and a half an inch of girth. Um, by the end of the year, its first year growing where it is right now, it was 25 inches, it grew eight inches, and it was 0.62 uh, in girth. The end of its fourth season, 2020, it was 35 and a half inches with 0.875 in girth. Its fifth year, the end of its fifth year, um, it was 43 inches in, in height and 1.1 in girth. End of 2022, its fifth year, it was 51.5 inches with a two inch girth. And then it, it, this year was its sixth year um, at alive, third third full year in, actually one, two, three, it's fourth full year where it, where it sits. It was 58 inches in height and 2.3 inches in girth. I have the other trees also charted like this, but this has got to be pretty boring video, except for just a few geeks like us. So um, I'm gonna keep on charting this. These trees are covered winterized right now, so Lord willing, next year they will um, take off growing again.